The cops are so bad. Dude, watch. What, what are the fucking... Dude, dude, here. I got to play the replay. Look at this. Bro. Bro. Look. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Look at this. So this guy, this guy that fucking got out. interview which is awesome um before we move on to that apparently there's another police chase and yes i am aware that there is a live crime coverage happening okay but i think that a lot of you chatters forgot that like the person who's currently watching the live crime coverage happening in real time also literally was talking about how i should be banned well he said you know that I should be banned for watching live crime coverage. Do you have goldfish brain? Like, you think if I watch this right now, after, uh, you know, Twitch didn't ban me, you think it's, it's uh, you know, you think, I could, you think I could get away with watching this? Everybody does this. Everybody watches this. Do you think I can get away with watching this, you think? Yeah, I'll just react to his stream instead. I'll react to him reacting to the crime. There will be a litany of charges potentially filed. This way, you know. Is joining us now, our law enforcement expert, and Bruce, we can. Well, we're almost 120. Seeing it correctly on this vehicle, it does look like he has a delay, and then I have a delay on top of the delay. There's part of me that thinks that might be a good thing for the commute. Uh, for people who are driving, they might... This is the most ethical way I can do it. Kind of this way, XQC can't get mad at me or Twitch for the inconsistency. You know what I'm saying? Here, we'll do it. We'll do it ethically. You know, because he is the referee, guys. So... Station. Okay, so we know... Well, we do know that that is in the general space that it began. There was at least... Ooh. One point uh, where the XGC is like your annoying little millionaire brother. Yeah, I know. Unhinged Andy. So, uh, they were northbound on Fig from Redundant. This is genuinely fucking insane. That this is the second time in, the chase, but in a span of like one week that another cop car has been stolen. Yeah, they have to chase because it's a cop car for something. Uh, they, they, because you are presented with something incredibly different. This is the second time. It's a woman too, girl bossing. If, if this wasn't a cup car and there was no gun inside, they wouldn't just on the highway at this, at this speed. With this much traffic, they wouldn't. Apparently, it's a lady. What the fuck is happening? Yeah, it's a change for a lot of reasons. I actually don't understand how this is like twice in one fucking week. What's happening? Does the fucking L.A. Sheriff's Department and the L.A. Police Department have so much money that they're just like leaving cop cars around? Like, are they just leaving the fucking cop cars everywhere? I don't get it. And you look at the rooftop of the vehicle, you'll see the 143, but you'll also see the 28. And 28 is the Compton. Remember, these fucking cars also have guns. We do, we do know that. Now, now, this is out of my ignorance. There are the, the what they're face? not locked in any mechanisms within the vehicle. <coughs> they need to be accessed quickly, and that's why they're not locked. And that's a question that I... I Bro, really this dude is doing 109 awesome. miles, dude. Sort of doing 109 miles on the Artesia Freeway. That is an insane... Easy. Yeah. He's doing crazy speeds. Like, this is profoundly fucking dangerous. To put the shotguns in. However, once the vehicle engine is engaged, there is a release button for both weapons. Yo, yo, yo. What if they're sniping the audio? <laughs> this guy just leaked that you could just unlock the fucking shotgun and use it when you, uh, you know. A suspect who is desperate enough to steal... A we uh, steal a vehicle of law Bro is live on there. He's like a... Oh, swerving. The vehicle and swerving. swerving. You'll see this person losing Hold your finger control. against the seat. The the you feel a button? If you click, it releases two uh, guns. It is an like, SUV the? and you're driving oh, this vehicle shit. at about 110 miles an hour. So, you know, there's a lot going on here that makes this really tough. Yeah, it, 
They're leaving their cars on parked illegally while they get their Chipotle order? What do you mean? Bro, it makes no fucking sense. There's no LA traffic. Guys, here's a trick. Some of the highways on Los Angeles, when it's off of rush hour, have no traffic whatsoever. Some of the highways in Los Angeles, depending on which direction you're going, even on rush hour will have no traffic, as a matter of fact. A lot of people don't realize this, but rush hour traffic goes one way usually. That's it. You showed a death last time you did this? Yeah, um, a guy, the last time someone, last time this happened, a dude decided to eject himself in the fucking car. Um, I clicked away. Uh, he died later. But this time, luckily, don't worry, I'm watching XQC, whose reaction time is way faster. Um, this is the most ethical way that I can react uh, to... Since he, he brought it up, since this happened last week, and he decided to bring it up again, I thought, you know, what better, what better way to uh, react to crime by, uh, you know, reacting to XUC, react to a, a crime, because, you know, he is the referee, ultimately. You know what I mean? They have weapons. This is, they know what she has in that vehicle. Um, La Cienega just got fixed, by the way. Yes. Uh, yeah, there's still parts of it that aren't fixed. This is Holland's vehicle, highway. His highway is infinite. As the deputy assigned that vehicle may have a war bag, an equipment bag with some additional stuff in it. But then, but at, at that point, if that deputy is, you know, he is obviously going to have been able to alert authorities as to what he had, yes? Yeah, sure. he put out over the radio, this is, a, this is a, going to be a high-risk uh, felony stop when they finally terminate mm -hmm. Um You've got multiple vehicles behind them. I mean, okay. what he means by that and is that we see the vehicle everybody's going to be gun drawn and the person comes out with uh, so something in their hands and they're going to be shot. At, That's uh, what they're saying. High speeds, even though it's under the 100 miles an hour, but now you're seeing going across three, four lanes of traffic. Wait, hold on. In and out, and it does not appear as if this person has... Does anyone have the live footage? I'll just throw it up on a different tab. Anytime soon. I'll throw it up on a different tab, and I'll play the audio from the tab, and I'll just mute XQC. Yeah, so that, uh, you know, I can do my live commentary. Uh, here, we'll, we can watch it on a delay here. Wait, why is there no audio here? Is there any... There's no audio on the on the L.A. County police chase uh, uh, link that you sent me. Mentioned the exits we've passed in our extreme nav technology shows us that we're just passing East Street Raymond Avenue uh, in Orange County, there you go. Kevin. We're also getting word from officials that even though that there are weapons locked up, even though that this uh, s female suspect behind the wheel as I can't believe this is a female. That's 91. crazy. We exited here. It looks like Raymond Avenue as we're sk skirting on by. It's come to a stop uh, trying to get by these vehicles. Kevin, we understand that it takes a whole other set of keys to unlock where those weapons are within the cruiser so in other words this suspect would not have access this is a great to this is a great year for ladies dude up, which of big year is a huge relief women's women's month uh yeah, i mean is, women's month just design. ended um you see now we're getting off into surface street to get here we're northbound on raymond we're in the anaheim and fullerton also areas. suspect is driving back and forth using the opposite lanes of traffic here and keeping keeping up those speeds there um, on these surface streets. Yeah, he's on he's on the side streets now. Westbound on Orange Thorpe, and that's going to keep us just north of the 91 freeway here, but moving back westbound. And like I said, this is going to run us alongside in the Fullerton area, north of the 91 freeway. We'll be uh, we'll be passing through the uh, Fullerton. Uh, I keep saying he, but is this? Yes, yes, uh, yes, yes. Whatnot, I know. Speed 90 miles an hour here. We are still on surface streets going by going by cars that are going about 35 miles an hour uh, like they're standing still here and coming up up to an intersection you see there is a green light ahead now trying to make a southbound turn southbound on lemon that's going to kind of take us back towards the 91 freeway so we'll see if uh if, if they if, if bro the hitting 84 on a side street like that is uh, fucking bananas crossover or tries to get back onto the freeway absolutely bananas direction. 
and it looks like we're gonna we're still we're just about to come up to that 91 freeway here wrong almost almost decided to take a wrong way of traffic there but there was a there was a tow truck that was coming northbound so we're still moving southbound on lemon lemon street and going over the over the 91 freeway and then continuing so we're going to continue southbound on lemon here now this street does dead end up ahead so you can go left or right on la palma when it comes to it now okay, there's a car there was a truck that was making left turn there yep so they had to squeeze around now we're on a smaller commercial street here yeah, so it's East so the ground, Commercial the, Street. They're trying to get the ground units into this here and trying to see because this this is kind of like a dead end area here. This is a dead end. Um, the only way I'm trying to look at the map here. The only way they kind of might be able to come back out. So they they have also also authorized the pit earlier in this pursuit. Hmm. So this is coming up to a dead end. The airship is calling a dead end up ahead here because it's going to come up to the train track. So there's Obviously. not going to be much much more of this. Yeah, because uh, clearly the suspect doesn't know that she is headed toward a dead end street. So we're going to see how this all plays out. Uh -oh. I saw the black and white. There's that dead end. Oh, she's on a dead end. I'm watching. Oh, shit. I'm not sure which kind. I'm watching ahead of time. And the audio is ahead of time. It's spoilers. She's on a dead end street. What the fuck? This is where she actually is. Excuse me. She's watching on a delay. Trying to find their way out. Oh! Yeah, she's trying to find her way out now. Kind of parallel, on, on actually on the railroad tracks there almost, and then cut back out. And still. Oh they're, they're shit! Up a containment of everything here. Okay, it's about almost getting stuck in the. The dirt real here. dead end they're, they're is the dead end to the, the content end. at the top of the hour when there's a three minute ad break. If you no longer want to see those ads, all you need to do is subscribe, which you can do for five dollars or for free with a Twitch Prime. Let's go. That's the real dead end to the content, unless you subscribe for five dollars or for free with Twitch Prime, or by getting gifted a sub if you're lucky. She's still going. She's going. This is bananas. Oh shit! So while we thought that that was going to be a surefire way to end this, it doesn't. Oh, there's the pit. Okay, they're trying to. They're trying to. Yeah, they're trying. Oh, they're trying to pit maneuver her. They busted out the pities. Oh, she's cooked. Okay. She's cooked. They have guns uh, pointed at her. Holy fuck. They think that she does not have access to weapons, I think. Plenty of deputies out. Obviously, their guns drawn. This is a very dangerous situation because, A, she's using the vehicle as a deadly weapon. There are weapons inside, although we understand that. Bro, they are wide open. Their fucking cops are literally. I don't think they think that she has guns. Oh, they blocked her in. It's over. The cops are so bad. In there. Okay, so it's just a matter of time. The cops are so bad. Dude, watch. What what are the fucking dude dude here? I gotta play the replay. Look at this. Bro! Bro! This is a very Look. dangerous situation because A, she's using the Watch this, watch this, watch this. There are weapons inside, although we understand that she doesn't have access to the weapons. Look at this. So this guy, this guy that fucking got out. Cop quest that's moving. Oh my goodness. So this He's trying to unlock it with the key. But it didn't yeah, he got out of it, but he didn't lock it into gear. He didn't lock it into gear. And then thank goodness he was able to get back in there. Well she clearly fucking didn't use that opportunity strikes, you know what I'm saying? Uh you see all of the deputies now at the rear, guns drawn. It doesn't what's going on right now, but the driver will they, be able they don't. To con oh, they're coming in. They're coming in with the units. Wait, XQC is watching this in real time now, I think. Oh, no, there's a delay. So there's no way, even, even, though, that, even though that other uh, SUV rolled back. Uh, the oh, they took her out. Completely blocked up ahead. So you can see there's an arrest team that's kind of making. They pulled her out. Their, they pulled her out. Their team together there alongside as well as a shield. Uh, so they may try to come up to the vehicle and just try to uh, pull a lot of struggle going on there, which is a good sign. So it looks like the person is just giving up at this point. So deputies putting the cuffs on her. 
and so far the, so what like this I, is what I don't understand though like how do they know that she did not have a gun that happened throughout this pursuit with especially with those speeds of 100 miles an hour or more that's what's crazy yeah, about this upwards of 100 miles per hour 120 at one point uh, and plenty of near misses so yes now the suspect is on her feet what does she got on her t-shirt we're seen as we zoom in trying to get a better look but those deputies are now going to cart her off to jail uh, this all happened at 1 30 and kevin do we know we understand that the vehicle was parked was this person stopped by deputies when they when she stole the cruiser do we know um we don't know we we are we're hearing that it just says security a, a came out on the radio that uh deputy said someone jumped into their car um, this was out of the city, uh, city of Compton, where this all started. So mm -hmm. what we had heard initially was that um, the, the deputies called out that somebody was in, into their car. There was a second patrol unit that was with that those deputies, so they were able to start the pursuit right off of the bat. But you can see here it, that it, person being taken into custody, kind of wearing a security yeah. uh, a shirt that says security on the back. So we will have to uh, later get the backstory on exactly who this is who this suspect is and what in it, uh, what what prompted them to just jump in the ve vehicle and get started but it doesn't it does so far it doesn't sound like this was on a traffic stop this was just they were all right well they're not gonna they're not gonna somebody this person just jumped into the vehicle and took off and you're absolutely right about that nice observation that the uh shirt that the suspect has on says security on the back so We'll work to find out uh, more information about the suspect, how this happened. And uh, to your point, too, Kevin, thank goodness there were plenty of. His QC. Misses, but as far as we saw, no actual Excuse snake. accidents as a result of the reckless driving, the dangerous driving, the erratic driving that we all witnessed mainly on the 91 and then on those surface streets with speeds beyond 100 miles per hour. Cop car being 187 yeah, is crazy. Like, like, like you were just, we were just talking about. At, the, at those speeds, I, it could have been... I thought uh, cop cars did have a kill switch. Like, I'm surprised that they don't. I, I don't really understand how, like, but, that doesn't like work. I said, luckily, I, I didn't hear the airship call out any collisions that, that this uh, this pursuit... Uh, His QC is funny. All, or XQ Snake is funny. Compton and ending up in uh, Anaheim here. Brother, right. brother is never getting that force and record, okay? Hey, hey, hey. How about instead of fucking crying about double standards, dude, you fucking work hard to defeat Forsen in, in the Minecraft speedrunning, which is not going to happen regardless of however many fucking seeds he throws. No one, as far as we know, injured that suspect now in custody by L.A. County Sheriff's deputies. We'll have the very latest coming up for you tonight on the Fox 11 News at 5 o'clock. For now, I'm Marla Teo. What the fuck? You know the officer's uh, uh, car going backwards? Yeah, that was pretty funny. That was a highlight. Carry on. Dude, I don't fucking understand. Like, you should definitely, if you're a cop and you get your car, you get your cop car stolen, which has a fucking, like, shotgun in it in many circumstances... You should definitely get into trouble. Like, they, you should get into trouble. That's insane. Look at this. So this the, 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 the cop moment is pretty funny. Like, the, this guy fucking forgetting to put it in the park. You lose your cop powers and the criminal becomes a cop now? Yeah, they let they should let the criminal become the cop. You mean transfer departments? Like, there is no world in which... There is no... I know, bro, I saw your text message. There's no world in which you can, like, get away with a, a, a thing like that. You know what I mean? And then they're gonna... No, this guy losing uh, his vehicle, like, that's pretty funny. It's, it's, this is a heat of the moment situation. No, it's not Murad. It's Austin. This is a heat of the moment situation. So it's like not that big of a deal. I mean, it's a massive problem because like she could have literally kept going through this and actually could have like driven, dr uh, 
He put other cops' lives in jeopardy. He put people's lives in jeopardy by not doing the right thing and, and putting the car in park. Okay? She could have just kept going and, and even plowed through cops, plowed through uh, citizens. You know what I mean? Uh, all that sort of stuff. He fucked up for sure. He should also get in trouble. But that's a more excusable thing because it's like happening. Um, th th it's happening when there is, uh, you know, a heat of the moment situation where he thought that he could like, uh, he thought that he was, you know, doing the right thing, immediately going into action, right? Oh, Springing into action. Oh. Oh. But the fucking first cop, like, if you're a cop, if you're a fucking cop, and you, are you done? Are you leaving? This fucking guy, bro. I swear to God. A lot of trash here. I wasn't expecting to say hi for a minute. I mean, I wasn't expecting to come on stream and everything, but wow. <laughs> Austin just uses my house as a bathroom. Dude, he, I was in the I was in the neighborhood. He texted like, me. He texted me. He's like, I gotta pee. I was yeah. I just had to pee, and so I just thought I'd come in and say hello and uh, wish Hassan the best of luck on D Day tomorrow, which is a big day for you. I'm so yeah. excited. Donald Trump is getting arrested. He's getting arrested, folks. He's getting yeah. arrested. Did you, what do you think about, you are our liberal correspondent, yeah, first sure. of all. Uh, yeah. Yeah, we love crime. We yep. just watched a little bit of crime. Yeah, yep. I'm okay. very pro-crime. Well, first and foremost, for the record, I didn't watch crime. I watched XQC react to crime. Okay. Because, like, that's the only ethical way of doing it. Of course. So that, like, uh, you know, so that I won't get, I, I won't get, you know, arrested uh, by XQC's right. uh, police force. Yeah, of course. Yeah. So <clears throat> what, what, what do you, what, what sort of lib take do you need? Um, well, this part was whatever. It's uh, funny, but, uh, it, Donald Trump is, as you know, getting arrested tomorrow. Uh, -huh. what do you think about this inside Trump's demands for a high profile surrender? It's 